the Israeli army has failed to fulfill Netanyahu's goal of destroying Hamas. Despite all efforts, during the special operation in the Gaza Strip, Israel was able to eliminate no more than 30 to 35 percent of Hamas militants. And the situation is the same with underground traffic tunnels. Approximately two-thirds of the passages remain intact. Politico writes about this. The Israel Defense Forces failed to complete the task set by Prime Minister of the Jewish State, Benjamin Netanyahu, to destroy the Hamas movement. Moreover, according to American intelligence, the movement not only compensated for the losses among militants suffered during the Israeli operation, but also managed to recruit new ones. To date, Hamas losses are estimated at no more than 30% of the total number and the underground tunnels continue to function. According to senior American officials, Israel's strategy in the Gaza Strip does not lead to final victory. Tel Aviv is catastrophically missing the opportunity to destroy Hamas. Against this background, well-founded fears arise that Israel in Palestine will repeat the US mistake in Iraq where an entire anti-American insurgency has grown out of ordinary resistance. They are echoed by the Biden administration which believes that after the Israeli army withdraws from the Gaza Strip there will be a vacuum that will quickly be filled by another terrorist group that has set itself the task of destroying the Jewish state. The possible withdrawal of Israeli troops could leave a vacuum that will likely be filled by chaos, anarchy and ultimately Hamas again, Blinken said. Nevertheless, Israel does not intend to listen to the advice of the Americans, preferring to act according to its own plan. However, this does not prevent the Israelis from receiving assistance from the United States. Давай, давай. Не, 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 не,